Well, investigators say a woman swindled hundreds from locals who thought they were getting a deal on theme park tickets, including tickets to SeaWorld. A deal is probably not a deal, right? Orange County deputies picked her up on a felony warrant last night. New at 5.30, Channel 9's Lauren Seabrook has been trying to speak with that suspect. And Lauren, you're live at SeaWorld for us because you talked to a victim who says he paid her $270 to try to get into SeaWorld. Yeah, Greg, and he thought he was saving a lot of money. Tickets here usually start at about 80 bucks. He was only paying $30, but when he brought those tickets here to SeaWorld, they told him those tickets had been used several months before. Some people who thought they were getting killer prices to be splashed by Shamu, greeted by Mickey and Minnie, or thrilled by the rides at Universal, ended up filing reports with law enforcement instead. If you're going to buy tickets from someone else, you have to wait till they get you into the park and then pay them. Angel Acevedo Vega learned it the hard way. He's one of at least three victims who investigators say fell for a scam by 22-year-old Tabricia Hendry. They say Hendry listed fake theme park tickets on this marketplace site OfferUp for just $30 between November of 2017 and May of 2018. And Acevedo Vega bought nine of them for SeaWorld. I had some friends that were coming from Colombia so I'm like, okay, it's a good deal. She was selling them for 30 bucks. He paid her 270 bucks total, but a few days later, he says she called and told him the tickets were stolen and... That she was going to send me the money Western Union, la, 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 and she never um, gave me back my money. We tried calling several phone numbers for her, but they were either disconnected or no one answered. Orange County deputies picked up Hendry last night on a felony warrant for scheme to defraud and petty theft charges. And Hendry's bond was just $2,500, so she was out of jail by this morning. Reporting live in Orange County, Lauren Seabrook, Channel 9 Eyewitness News.